Hi, I'm Morag from our Permaculture Life. I live in an eco-village here in southeast Queensland and one of the things I love about living in an eco-village is the opportunity to share as a community. And one of the things that we're doing at the moment is actually being part of a cow collective. And what that means is that there's a, about a dozen families who get involved and each of us take turns at milking a cow. So on Wednesday, it's our family's day to go milk. And we collect the milk and we process it for cheeses and yogurts and, and have access to our own fresh raw milk, which is fabulous. So, you know, I can't utilise as much milk as it would have, to, you know, if I had a cow that I had to milk every day, I don't need that much milk. Whereas by being part of this cow collective, it's just a way to actually share the work, share the labour and share the milk too. And, and share the joy because it's such a fantastic thing having animals and being part of it. Now where we are here in this eco village we only have one acre that's our own bit that we that we look after with our gardens. It's not enough for cows either. So by working together with the community we can actually lease out a section of land and, and have a have a shared amount of cows that we that we look after. And we do it in a really gentle way. So the the mums um, still have their calves on them and we just take a little bit and they get fed all different sorts of things from seaweed to minerals and they're all looked after organically and have neem oil painted on their backs to make sure that you know the buffalo flies don't get into them and so they're lovingly cared for by so so many people and they're just very lucky cows I think. Anyway so we're off this morning um, we off on a Wednesday morning to go and do our turn of milking so I've taken my camera with me and I just wanted to show you a few of the things that we do down at the milking sheds and, uh, and everyone in my family has a job to play uh, has a job to do even the four-year-old so um, come and have a look and see what we do and and um, yeah I'll see you down at the farm so with the food we use pollard and that's the whole cloth then we also have barley crumbles which is a supplement We've also got barley supplement, which is another type of barley that we use. And with the other stuff, there's seaweed, diatomaceous earth, we've got dolomite, and we've also got this apple cider vinegar that we add in. So, yeah, that's what the food is. And we why, also, do we do, why do we give it to them? Well, it keeps them busy while we're doing them, but it also allows us to check them over while we're doing it, while we're milking. And what are we checking them over for usually? Well, usually for ticks or buffalo flies. Mm. So they're pretty lucky with all yeah. cows, aren't they? They get all these little extra treats yeah. and they particularly like the molasses, don't they? They come running for that. Alright, so let's get the food ready and we'll go and get them. Monty, what's happening? What are they doing? Oh, that's some apple cider vinegar. You need some water in there. <coughs> you got molasses? No, no, no. Yeah. Alright, let's go and get some apple cider vinegar. Oh, we probably, oh, we don't, yeah, we can leave it there. That's a great idea. Thanks, Monty. Alright, now let's go, Let's go. Hey, so what cow are we getting out first? Well, let's see who wants to come, shall we? Who do you think is going to come first? Morning girls! You want to call them Monty? Give him a call. Alright, just the one. Alright Annabelle, come on darling. Let's go. Here we go. Here she comes, Monty. You ready for her? Alright, put the back in there. Lovely. Okay, grab the rope. Okay, so we need to turn the milking machine on. 